Let's go down and check out the Kuloa Point Trail and these cool pools down here. It's only a half mile. And then we'll come up and check out the Waimuku Falls two mile, two hour round trip hike. The advantage of um, sleeping here in the campground, keep a Hulu campground overnight, is you can be the first guys into the pools in the morning because this gets to be a very crowded, popular tourist destination throughout the day. But it's a long drive for folks coming from anywhere other than Hana to get out here. Usual precautions. Yeah, it floods like hell up there in the mountains in Haleakala and rains come pouring down. There's some good pictures of those of these creeks when they're full of water. So the falls are two miles up that way and the um, ponds or the pools are a half mile down this way. And there's a neat example of early Hawaiian architecture. These rocks are a uh, site of an ancient Hawaiian village. Of course, they're always fishing villages. the rocks. Oh wow. There it is. There's the bridge of Highway 37 going to Hana and the falls. You get here first thing in the morning you could be the first person here. Have the whole place to yourself briefly. Here's where the trail to the falls crosses 37. <laughs> Look both ways. The road to Hana. From the back way. No dogs. Thank goodness. What happened here? Wow. Yep, I'd say so. Bamboo. I don't know if that's supposed to be here. I think it's an invasive species. Look at across the creek. Looks like the kinds. Oh, it's freaking bamboo. Makahaiku Falls, is that how you say it? it means dangerous falls. Woo wee! So, all that rustling noise must have been the cattle. And here's the uh, fence to keep the cattle in. Just like in Nevada, only different. A lot different. Nice steps built into the trail here. Very well developed trail system. Kind of 
quarry here. Look at how these roots climb through those rocks. The volume of water up here does not seem to match at all the much lower volume of water down below, downstream by the ocean, indicating to me that a lot of this water is disappearing in through the porous volcanic rock on its way to the ocean. The brown color means rain. You certainly don't need a 20 pound pack for a day hike like this, a two mile hike, but when you're on a bike, what are you gonna do? You got all your stuff, you gotta take it with you. Besides, I need the exercise and the practice. More adventures ahead. <laughs> look at that. Looks like the kinds. Bamboo, wow. Hiking through the bamboo forest. Talked to the nice park lady there, and yep, sure enough, this is uh, invasive bamboo from China. Don't know when it started, but it's been here a while. But it's got its own natural beauty. But it is choking out a lot of the native species in the process. So about a mile to go from these crossings to the big falls. It's gonna take kind of a bit of a hike. Got us some elevation here to climb up. I definitely do not recommend sandals for this hike. Bring some sturdy shoes, lots of roots and rocks. That bamboo is so thick, you can't see barely 10 feet into there. Need to import some panda bears to eat this stuff up. Of course, when you get in here, not a breath of wind can make it in here, so it's kind of stifling. Big diameter.
plugs up all these gorges. It's like <sighs> yeah. we out of that bamboo forest. Whoa, there it is. Wow. Almost there now. Oh yeah, it's right there. Wow. Made it across without getting my feet wet or dropping the camera. Here we are. Waimoku Falls. Water that recognizes no friend. 400 feet. You don't want to get underneath that water because. All kinds of debris and rocks and boulders are coming down that water. Here's what it, well, normally looks like. A little bit more than normal right now. And then, after a good rain... Wow, look at the difference in volume and color of the water now. It's really raining a lot more up country, up in the mountain there. Big difference. Short period of time, maybe an hour. Look out. Look at that flow now, an hour later. Chocolate brown. So it's about a two hour round trip hike up to the Wai Waimoku Falls um, and a bit of elevation change as well. And a neat hike through the bamboo forest. 400 foot falls up there, worth checking out. And then uh, the pools below the bridge are just right down here. Waiamuko Falls, Maui, 400 foot drop. About a two mile hike up to here from the Highway 37, near Hana.